whiteboard project management YouTube channel used to explain to you the tools and techniques used in the project management in a very practical way. In today's episode, we will do something different. We will go through the changes announced by the Project Management Institute, the changes related to the project management standards in 2021. Those changes has been applied in the new PIMBO guide, the seventh edition. The new PIMBO guide, the seventh edition, will be released in August 2021. That means the next month. So we will go briefly to compare those changes the new standards with the previous standards which was applied in the PIMBO guide the 7th 6th edition stay connected if you are interested in project management project leadership or you are a project manager this will be important to you for executing your projects grab your cup of coffee prepare your white sheets and let's start the session Welcome to this episode. This is a briefly explanation about the changes in the project management standards in 2021. So in 2021, Project Management Institute had announced changes in the project management standards. Why? We will know from, the, from this presentation. Uh, this presentation serves as a briefly and very in a, uh, in a very short way explaining the changes and compare them to the previous changes uh, which was valid till 2021. So first, project management standards according to the PIMBO guide 6th edition means all the PIMBO guides uh, from the 1st edition till the 6th edition were based on knowledge areas we all used to uh, go through all the, those knowledge areas which are the initiating planning executing monitoring and controlling and closing those has not been changed those are still valid but we are now focusing on different way and thinking differently a little different as a project manager to execute your projects because the projects have has de developed and as a project manager you need to develop your thinking and start thinking a little differently according to the marketing requirements and project requirements so all the project management standards for all editions till the sixth edition were based on knowledge areas as we used, initiating, planning, executing, monitoring and controlling, and closing. In all projects, these are still valid. Now in the project management uh, standards, according to the PIMBO guide 7th edition, which was released just now, uh, for you as a project manager, if you are a member in Project Management Institute, you can download the uh, the electronic uh, version of the PIMBO guide, the seventh edition. So the PIMBO guide seventh edition contains the new project management standards. And those standards are now based on the 12 project delivery principles. The project management standards, the way of thinking is now focusing on the delivery of the project. Before it was focusing on initiating, planning, executing, monitoring and controlling and closing. Those are still valid, but the standards are now focusing on the project delivery principles. Means how you are going to deliver the, pro the project. As a project manager, you are responsible to deliver your project. So the 12 project delivery principles, stewardship, as you can see, stewardship, team, stakeholders, value, uh, holistic thinking, leadership, tailoring, quality, uh, complexity, opportunities and threats. Those are the risks. Adaptability and change management. So you can see that most of the items 
or most of the project delivery principles had been changed in names. You can, if you if you went through the previous PIMBOOK guides from PIMBOOK 5th edition, uh, there was a human resource management. PIMBOOK 6th, 5th uh, edition. 6th edition, it was a resource management. It's not now a human resource. It's a complete resource management. Now in this uh, seventh edition, you have a team. Okay, so the the way of thinking, the development of thinking for you as a project manager responsible to deliver the project, you need to start focusing on these things. Now, side by side, if I put the Pimbo Guide sixth edition side by side with the Pimbo Guide seventh edition and compare the project management standards in the sixth and the seventh edition, you can see that the seventh edition has a huge changes in the way of thinking. It's no more based on initiating, planning, executing, monitoring, and controlling because this, those are like standards of the project where you are doing it for all your projects. You always need to initiate, you always need to plan, you always need to execute, monitor and control and close. But the project management standards in 2021 focuses on the delivery principles. A message for you, that means for you as a project manager, now you, st you need to start thinking always to deliver your project. Not only to initiate, plan, monitor, and control and execute the project, but you need to deliver the project successfully. In order to deliver the, this project successfully, you need to have the correct principles, you need to have the correct idea, you need to learn how to think to combine and integrate all those principles to deliver your project successfully. In other episodes, I will go through each delivery principle and make one detailed um, episode for each principle, for stewardship, for team, for stakeholders, for value, tailoring, quality, and others. And you will see that the, the details of those um, principles. So main objectives and outcomes of those standards are focused on the project outcomes in addition, addition to deliverables. However, earlier editions focuses on the knowledge areas. Now, recommendations from whiteboard project management, you still need to read the PIMBOOK guide 6th edition if you are a new project manager. If you are a junior, pro uh, junior project manager, you are new here to project management, you still need to understand the, the sixth edition where it was, it was based on the uh, complete knowledge areas and process groups, as well as the agile management, and then move to the PIMBO guide seventh edition. So, in another way, the seventh edition doesn't cancel the sixth edition. The sixth edition and the seventh edition are completing all together. The only way that the seventh edition is focusing on the delivery of the project, delivery principles of the project for you as a project manager. So we still recommend to read the sixth edition. If you are new to project management, read the sixth edition, read the agile, and then move to the seventh edition and you will have the full picture. Thank you for watching this episode. If you have any comments, uh, any questions, feel free to write it down below in this uh, video or you can send it to Whiteboard Project Management email or you can contact on the social media shown in this uh, page. Thank you for watching and see you in the next episode.